Hi, hello guys, excellent slides here. We create excellent presentations. In this video, I will teach you how to create 3D morph effect just in PowerPoint. So as you might know, morph is a game changer in PowerPoint, but also in PowerPoint, you can add 3D models and those 3D models with morph effect can create really, really amazing effect. So I will show you how to make it. As you can see right here, we have just a photo. Of course, you can resize it, you can rotate it, etc, etc. But right here, I also inserted a model of, let's say, a photo of plane. But in this case, this is 3D model. So as you can see, also we can resize it. We can, of course, rotate it. But there is one more thing. As you can see right here, you have those kind of um, two arrows. And if you press on them, as you can see now, the magic happens. I can rotate my object in 360 degrees. And it's really amazing. And with more effect that I will, that I will share with you in a minute, it will look really, really amazing. So first of all, how you can add 3D models to PowerPoint. If you have Microsoft 365 subscription, you just need to go here, insert, and here you have 3D models. You can, you can click on this drop down arrow and here you have two options, this device and stock 3D models. If you have downloaded some 3D models on your own, then of course you can use this device option. But if you don't have any models prepared, you can click here. As you can see, new window pop up. And here we have some categories. There are plenty of them, so it's cool. And let's say we would like maybe go to the toys. And here you have some of those 3D models. Let's take this one and maybe this one. And you just click insert. And as you can see, um, maybe I will create a new slide. Yeah. So as you can see, we have two 3D models. And like I said you earlier, we can change the rotation in 360 degrees. So that's a game changer. So, you know, it looks really amazing, but with morph effect, it will look amazing. So I will show you what I mean. So let's create a new slide and insert this plane right here in the middle. And I think we can um, make it, yeah, in this rotation and place it right here. Now let's duplicate this slide. So Ctrl and D and we can change the rotation and position of our plane. So I think like that and we can make it bigger right here. All right. So as you can see right now, if I go into slideshow mode, so this is the slide. If I proceed to the next slide, this is um, a strange transition. But if I apply morph transition, the magic will happen. Look. As you can see, it looks really amazing. And you can create animations like that. For instance, uh, let's duplicate this slide. And now we will uh, change rotation once more and maybe change position here. Let's duplicate once more and maybe let's um, change the size and let's place it right here. And the last slide right here. So let's preview our slideshow. So as you can see, this is the first slide, the second, the third. As you can see, this transition looks really amazing and stunning. Like it was not made in PowerPoint, but yeah, it is absolutely possible. The only thing that you need to have is 
Microsoft 365 subscription, if I'm not mistaken, or you just need the newest version of PowerPoint. All right, guys, so I think it was everything that I wanted to share with you. Uh, once, um, please note that if you would like to use this effect, 3D models uh, with morph transition, uh, you will probably need a powerful PC or a laptop because 3D models and especially with morph effect, you just need powerful PC because then transition will look really smooth, not laggy, etc. So thank you guys for watching. If this video was valuable for you, subscribe to our channel. You can also turn on the notification bell. It's really appreciated. Have a great day and lead a happy life. Excellent slide.